Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are doing a slime video. <laughs> and what I mean by that is, I went online, I bought slime from what seemed to be popular brands who sell slime, and um, I'm just gonna like review it, or like, I don't know, like play with it with you guys. I watch slime videos on like Instagram stuff all the time, like at night, in the morning, like I watch them all the time, it's kind of weird. Like a long time ago, like when I first discovered it, I was like, this is like really cool. And I've just never really bought like actual slime. I've never made slime. So this is like my first time and I'm kind of really, really, really excited. Like I've been really excited for these packages to come in. And unfortunately only one came in so far, but I have to open it now. So like that's why this video is gonna be like a two-parter. Like, but I'm gonna make it into the same video, but yeah, only one of the slimes came today. I bought three slimes. Here's my package. And we're just gonna open them together, and this can be like a funny video to you guys or whatever. But I'm just really excited. The first slime that I bought is from Scented Slimes by Amy. I want to say it's called Scented Slime by Amy. She has an Instagram, she has a website, and everything. So here's the package. Um, when you open your package, you get. I'm gonna make it a little darker for you guys. I don't know if you can see this, but when you open your package, you get a little watermelon candy or whatever candy. You get a little bit of borax, which I'm going to be honest, I have no idea what to do with that. And then you just get her business card, which is super, super cute. But here's her business card for anybody who cares or wants to visit her Instagram or whatever the case may be. Yeah. So, after that, you I got ordered three slimes. So one of them is in here and two of them are in here. And this is super cute packaging. I've been like dying... I've been dying not to like actually open these all day and it's like really hot so I hope these are not melted. I'm gonna open this one first since this is what I'm most excited for. As you can see it's this really cute um, polka dot packaging. And then she wrapped it in bubble wrap. So like these are like safe, like you know nothing's gonna happen to these. So the first slime I ordered, oh my god, <laughs> I'm way too excited, I'm like a child, is called, I think it's like H2 melon or something, like f it's fish bowl slime. When I first started getting into slime, fishbowl slime is like what I wanted to try. It was like what I wanted to buy. Like, and this is watermelon fishbowl slime. Like, who wouldn't want this? So I'm just really excited to feel this. And I think it should be scented like watermelon. Whoa. So when you open it, it's kind of sticky. Okay, immediately it smells like watermelon. It smells really, 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 really good. Kind of like sour watermelon in a way. Alright, so let's just get the slime out of here. So far, it's really sticky. But that could have to do with, I guess, the weather. Here's what it looks like. Alright, it's not really focusing, but uh, all I have to say is this is like literally not fun. This is like so sticky. I don't know what it's supposed to feel like, but... Oh my god, it's like sticking to, to my hands real bad. Um, guys, look at my hands. This is like kind of ridiculous. My hands are like stuck together. It comes with this little watermelon charm, but other than that, ew. Excuse me while I go literally wash my hands off. Literally, I don't know what that is supposed to feel like. I, that's... I just don't see how that could be like fun at all. Ew. Please let me know how to fix that because these were not that cheap. Um, this was $9 and it's just like the H2 melon like fishbowl slime. Do I fix that with the borax or like what? Because that's kind of gross. Please don't tell me I wasted like $40 and please let these other two be good. Okay. The other kind of slime I've always been into is like bubblegum slime. I've always thought that that looked really cool on videos and stuff. So I ordered one from her called Bubble Blowing Baby Crunchy Slime. <laughs> this as well was $9. This is how Bubble Blowing Baby Crunchy Slime looks. It's just blue. It looks kind of fluffy and like crunchy. Let's just pray that this won't like be really sticky. It smells like good but like I don't know like cleaning like cleaning supplies kind of it has this really really cute like bubble gum machine on the top of it that's a really cute little charm 
I'm just going to take that out. We're just going to take out a little bit this time. This one's still sticky, but not like as sticky. So I'm a little more happy with this slime than I was the last slime. Let's just say that. But it's still sticky, so like what is it about her slimes that are sticky? But yeah, I'm much happier with this slime. And it makes pretty good sounds, so. But still just like sticky. And it's not. As you guys just heard my boyfriend say he can smell it, so. What does it smell like to you? Uh, watermelon. Oh, he smells the HTML one. Watermelon, green apple, citrus. Yeah. Something like sour. Guys, all the slime videos I watch, I don't see their hands covered and all this stuff. That's all I have to say. And I do have to say, like, it, it obviously has to go through the mail, so something could have happened to the slime. I'm not saying this is her fault, that it's so sticky. Okay, so I already know that the last one's gonna be sticky because it's a flume. And it's the only one that has, like, an actual, like, slime texture, kind of. So I know it's gonna be sticky. And this was the one I was the most excited for, but I don't even know if I'm excited anymore to just get my hands dirty, pretty much. This is called Eternally Grateful Flume. And this is $9. This is what she looks like. Looks really pretty. I can see some glitter in there and just cuteness. It is really cute and I was the most excited for this. So let's see what it smells like. Whoa, I can already tell the stickiness. Whoa, that smells seriously like grape. But also like chemical. Like, I don't know. Look at that stickiness, guys. Why is it sticky like that? Look at that. It smells good. Yeah, it's not. Okay, guys. I'm going to go get a plate or something and put this on the plate and just play around with it. All three of them and just actually try to, like, make it not so sticky or something. Now, bring you guys along with me. So far, my overall thoughts on all of these are just like, why are they so sticky? <laughs> like, do they always come like that? Is there something I have to do? From the other company, I ordered like seven slimes, so I hope they're not all just sticky. But yeah, I mean, overall, they're really cute and they smell good, but like, they're sticky, so what's the point? But these are them. Ash, what is that? Oh, go to it. It's one of my challenges is to get hit like the middle of the circle. Okay guys, sorry for the super awkward angle, but we're just gonna attempt to make one of these work. So I'm gonna empty out all, all of it onto this plate. We're starting with the um, bubblegum slime or whatever. <coughs> this one's smell isn't like the most pleasant thing in the world. I pretty much got as much as I could out. So this is the now the slime. It kind of reminds me of like, I don't even know. It said this was like stretchy or not, but it definitely just like breaks apart. So I wouldn't say this, this one is stretchy, but it definitely is like super, I guess you slime people would call crunchy. This is most likely my favorite one. And I kind of knew it was going to be my favorite one. And obviously just the stickiness and it just sticking to your freaking hands is horrible. Next, I'm going to try to empty the contents of this one, Eternally Grateful. Oh my god, it's so sticky, guys. Like, so incredibly sticky. Like, what is this disaster happening, guys? Seriously, what? like, this is just a disaster. It's honestly just making me mad. That one smells like grapes. Oh my god, I'm freaking out right now. Sean, look how sticky this stuff is. Just crazy to me. I can't even get it off my hands. That's why I'm getting so angry. This is so just not okay. I can't even get the rest of this off of my hands. 
Okay guys, so I have to go wash all of this off and waste product, but that took so long to even get into the package that I'm just over it and done, so I'll be back. I'm sorry about this like lighting because it's getting dark out and also excuse my sunburn, <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna just finish this video. So the last slime that I don't want to open again is the fishbowl slime. I don't even want to like attempt to get it out of the container. I'm gonna get a spoon. I was able to get it all out. So if I just like play with it, it isn't like the worst thing in the world. But guys, it's literally just, I don't know what all the hype is honestly. It's fun to watch the videos and stuff. Once you're just playing with it and it's like sticky and getting all over you, it's not fun. This one is cool though, it's like fishbowl. And it does initially have like a good sound and stuff. And the little beads are really cool. But whatever I'm doing right now is making it not, it's not sticking to me. But when I actually like pick it up, it's pretty sticky. Okay, so this one's definitely cooperating with me a little bit more now that I'm just sitting here mixing it up and stuff. So I'm not completely and totally mad at it. Let's just say that. Okay guys, so overall, that was the biggest waste of money of my life. I understand like all of her packaging stuff is like really adorable. She puts these little charms, like the packaging's cute. The slimes are really cute and like really good looking, but and they smell good, but the slime is really sticky and unplayable with technically, except for this one. This one's doable, but it's still sticky. This one you can only like poke and this one, I don't think I'll ever be able to play with. So just like overall, I'm not the happiest customer right now. Um, but let's see how the other company that I bought from does when their slime gets to me. Please, if you guys are little people who like slime, let me know what to do with this borax, how to use it, if I can fix my slime. Okay guys, so I look at the other side of this card, and it says, Included is some borax, so you can mix with water and use if your slime arrives too sticky. Mix the entire packet with a half cup of warm water, and add a few drops of time into your slime as a desired texture. Don't add too much or you can ruin your slime. Meaning, I think I can only use this with one of my slimes. So which one do I want not to be sticky? I don't know. Or I can just go buy a borax if I'm really that hurt about it. But like, I purchased slime because I wanted it to be good slime, you know? Slime rules. Wash hands before touching, I did that. Add shaving cream for fluffiness, I'll try that I guess. Add lotion for softness or stretch, slime's not edible and keep away from children and pets. Okay, there's also a little sticker that I didn't see before inside of the pack. A little sticker. And then my borax, that looks like a bag of cooking, so don't let this sit out, kids. <laughs> well, at least I can eat this candy. You know, that justifies the $40 I just spent. <sighs> I'll see you guys when my next package gets here. From Kawaii Slime Company. See you guys later. Hey guys, welcome back. I had to be a little quieter this time, um, just because I'm at my own house, not my boyfriend's house, and people are sleeping, it's late. Other thing is the fan I have to have on me right now. It is too hot. I with the ring light and everything, the fan has to be on. I'm sorry if you can hear it. But my other package came today from Kawaii Slime Company. That is the other place I ordered from. Um, I'm gonna attempt to cover my address, but who knows, but their little logo is like really cute. I know you can't see it, but I'm sorry. Um, but the inside is like actually Kawaii. It has like all these little power puffs. I did open the package, but I did not like open it as you guys can see I didn't actually take this stuff out I wanted to but I didn't my slime from scented slimes by Amy came literally in like a couple days I feel like I don't really remember but this took like two weeks so yeah and my boyfriend did pay for all of these slimes and he spent a moderate amount of money for how stupid the concept is so I felt bad like getting like the $20 shipping so I just got like the $15 shipping or whatever it was and yeah, 
let's just open this package up. I'm really, really, really excited. I don't know why I'm so nervous. It's because these slimes, like, went so wrong for me. Not wrong. Like, I love the slimes. I'm not going to, like, bash her because, you know, they're cool and everything. I kind of made the mistake of ordering slime in the hot, I guess, and they were just really sticky. Um, we'll talk about that more later. She has, like, this blue wrapping and a bunch of these little things, which are pretty cute. Um, so... I ordered, I want to say, five slimes, and if you ordered five or spent $50 or something, you get a free mystery slime. So I'm, like, really excited to see what my mystery slime is. Ooh. Okay. It looks so cute so far. So I'm just going to slide everything out. It looks like we have a lot of cute stuff in here. Um... One second, guys. I have to go like look a one more time at my order. I'm just a little bit confused. Let's bring this back up. Let me just reiterate, or whatever the f the word is. This order was seventy dollars and twenty four cents. Just putting it out there. And okay, let's go through this really fast so i ordered something called twisted mermaid whipped butter slime sorry guys i just got a little bit confused about everything for a second because it all looks a bit weird and it just wasn't exactly what i ordered but i think i understand now so i ordered something called twisted mermaid whipped butter so i'm gonna put a picture up of what it, the picture was and this is what it what i got just a blue slime um but then i noticed that it came with then I noticed that it came with this little mermaid thing with some sprinkles on the side. So I just figure, I guess I'm supposed to make it myself. But you can also see that there is leaking on the sides of the slime. So I don't know. Then I ordered something called Blueberry, Blueberry Bliss Flume Slime. And I'm going to show the picture. I'm sorry, but this does not look like that picture at all. It just looks like blue slime that I can make in my kitchen. This is the next one. This is called Meow Kiato Whipped Butter Slime and this does not look like how it was advertised at all. Very uh, interesting, but okay. This last one I ordered is called Secret Pearl 2 Rose Gold Edition. Um, this is probably the most interesting one I have yet. This actually kind of looks like the picture, but still it doesn't. Um, but I'm going to be honest, I'm feeling slightly scammed right now. This is probably the most real one so far. This is called the Tropical Fruit Cream Gloss Slime. And it just, this is what it was advertised as. I think I got pineapple flavor. They have, like, there's like a bunch of flavors or whatever. And I got pineapple. That looks like a banana. But it's a different story. I was supposed to get a full... A full size um, free slime if I spent $50. This is my full size, full size free slime. That's her right there. That's de that's definitely full size, you know, like definitely a full size slime. I really do appreciate this slime activator right here, though. It's like a lot easier than them just giving me like a bag of borax and I don't know what to do with it. And then they just gave me a cute candy in there, and I actually really like those candies, so I'm excited about that. So this is what I got, and this one is leaking. Um, so now all we can do is tell off of smell and actually like how they feel. But now that I can actually see these compared to like these, I'm extremely impressed with how Amy Slimes looked on the website. Is how they came to my door. You guys like you know what I mean? These look nothing like the picture, and I'm highly disappointed. But let's see how they come. I'm gonna open my free slime first, just to see like what it is or whatever. Okay, so so far it doesn't seem as sticky as my ones that I got. Oh, definitely not as sticky, so that's definitely good. Oh my god, that smells really good. <laughs> like honestly, it smells really good. I ain't even mad 
anymore. Okay. Um, here's the slime. It's this smells like literal creamsicle. Like, oh my god. That makes me like actually want to go eat a creamsicle. And I think I have some like in my basement right now. So I would have to go do that. Um, I'm extremely happy that I can actually play with this and because I couldn't really play with the other ones that I got. But okay. So this is making me a little happier. I mean, it was definitely not a full size, but like, holy crap. That smells so good. Putting you back because we have a few more to get through. Mm. Oh my god, I have to go eat a cookie go now, I'm serious. This slime is like huge. Like, Did I like spend more for like this size? Because I hope I didn't. The next slime we're going to be checking out is... um. The tropical fruit slime that I got in pineapple. So let's just go ahead and open that up. And I'm pretty sure this is like a glossy slime. Ooh, this thing looks sticky. Okay. Where does this girl get her scent? Because that actually smells like freaking pineapple. Like it's actually kind of strange. Holy crap. We're just gonna take a look at this because this is unplayable with. Just like my other slime. This is like actually kind of gross like that is crazy sticky like disgusting that is wow okay okay i'm gonna go to the bathroom and wash this off how more disappointing can this day possibly get i'm still just astounded that like the pictures look so pretty and then mine comes looking like a solid color like every single one of these is like a solid color but next we're gonna play with the one that um leaked Ew, it's like stuck closed because it leaked okay that's interesting this one looks like it's gonna be gross as well oh that smells so good what is that even supposed to smell like? I need to like read that. It says that um, it's scented with an intoxicating island sand scent, which is noted with bright citrus, sweet florals, and spicy vanilla. Oh my, like you guys, like I just want these scents like for my room. Like I just want all of these scents in a thing, in my bowl, spraying in my room. I'm not as mad because I should have read the thing. It says each jar comes with the charm and glitter to decorate yourself so um i'm really scared to put my finger in there because what happened with the last one? Oh my god this one feels so much better okay so this is butter slime and whenever i watch my slime videos at nighttime, which i always do um butter slimes are like one of my favorite ones to watch like imagine like, going to the beach but just being at like the beachiest beach ever and like just sniffing the beach <laughs> like that's what this smells like Oh my god, okay, anyway, let's decorate it. We're just gonna pour our little things into there. And now it actually looks a bit like the picture, let's be honest. Like this could look like the picture, okay? I'm not as mad anymore. Um, I'm just gonna take that charm right back out. <laughs> Cause I mean, I don't really need it in there. And um, we're just going to play with it a little bit and honestly, this is fun. Like, I actually really like this one. I'm going to attempt to take some out. Because isn't that what I'm supposed to do? I'm not just supposed to leave it in the jar. It is a bit sticky when you take it out. But I'm sure the slime activator that she included could help with that. Like, how do all those slime people, like, make it look so easy? I'm going to try that slime thing with, with butter slimes and people go... Mm -hmm. Okay, it does work, but it's not, like, as cool as they make it look. Alright, I sprayed one pump, and she said just knead it in to the slime. So, I guess that means this. Mm. I guess it worked a little bit. Ew, no, it didn't. There is, like, a gross hair in the lid. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that's pretty interesting. I forgot to mention this pineapple one was um, $8.99 and this blue one was $12.99. The next one I'm going to try is this Meow Chiato Whipped Butter Slime. This is $10.99. This is supposed to smell like a caramel macchiato and uh, I drink those every day. So I'm really excited about this. Um, I am upset because it says each of these comes with a cat charm 
Mine did not come with the cat charm, so I'm upset about that, Kawaii Slimes. Um, this one smells really good. It smells like macchiato caramel, but it also kind of smells like a pretzel. Like she was going for that like salty kind of taste. Uh, I don't know. It's okay. Let's just, I'm not going to take this one out of the container because it's practically open anyway, but um, it's not really sticky at all. It's actually really pleasant and nice, and I really like it. And yeah, I'm just upset that I didn't get my cat charm. But other than that, honestly, get it. <laughs> if you're gonna get any from her, like get this. I just wanted to point out to you guys that I'm on her website and she has these little heart things right here that I got as my free full-size slime on here as an add-on for 99 cents. So that's so annoying because like I purposely spent $50 to get a full size slime, you know? So like that's what I want. All right, the next one we're dabbling into is the Blueberry Bliss Foam Slime. And in the picture you can tell there's a lot more prettier foam in there and oh, looks like I just got <laughs> a slime that's blue. Oh, it was hiding. Alright guys, the f the big flumes are in there. I'm sorry if I sounded mean. They are in there, but it looks way prettier on the website. But I'm super excited. This one looks super sticky, so I am just going to give it a spray. Um, but... Oh my god, it's not pleasant. At all. Oh my god, not this again. No. I don't even know if I can attempt to do this. I can't. Oh my god. That one sucks. That might be the worst one other than the yellow one. Like, these two are on the same damn boat, guys. Like, they're both pretty bad. This last one, actually, I think is not on her website anymore. Yeah, this one's not on her website anymore, but... This was actually a slime that I added on last minute just because I wanted to reach the $50 to get this. <sighs> anyway, this was $12.99. It's huge. Um, it doesn't look... I mean, the little sparkles do look pretty. I'll show you guys the picture. I got it because the picture looked really pretty. It doesn't look like the picture, but let's open it. I think it's going to be unpleasant. Oh, yep. I can already tell it's going to be unpleasant just because of... How sticky it looks. By the way, the last one smelled um, really unpleasant. It smelled like dirty blueberries. Okay, this smells good. It smells like one of those smells from Victoria's Secret. Like, it honestly kind of smells like she just, like, put some perfume in this. Which is kind of strange, but... Right. Oh, God. I can already tell, guys, that I'm not going to like this at all. I just sprayed some of that in there. Is there, like, something I can, like, mix it with? I'm gonna take the end of this this thing. I'm just gonna wash it off later, but I'm not. I'm just. I just cannot put my finger in that. But I'm just gonna mix that around, like that activator stuff. Oh wow! So there's supposed to. It's called the Secret Pearl Two Rose Gold Edition, and I found the Secret Pearl. So that's kind of cool, I guess. I'll try to show you guys that. So do you guys see that little pearl in there? And when I was looking for on the website, they don't have this anymore, but they have the Secret Pearl 3. So I just guess she does these things like Secret Pearl, blah, blah, blah. But that's kind of cool, actually. Um, the activator seems to have worked a tiny, tiny speck. So I'm going to go ahead and dip my finger in. Nope, it's still super bad. Okay, guys, so after a hundred dollars or so of slime um i'm highly disappointed <laughs> and while there is some slimes here that i enjoyed like i really like most like i do like the little free slime that i got and i really like the meow Giotto. i don't like that i didn't get my cat i love this slime by amy slimes i'm just gonna have to f try to fix them with that activator because these are seriously high quality slimes if you guys are going to buy slime do it from her because i would trust this. This looks just like her pictures. Um, as for Kawaii Slime, it doesn't really look like the pictures. 
I guess it does kind of, but like not 100%. And if you go for them, definitely go for the butter slime because like these are like crazy, crazy, crazy sticky. Like I don't, I think they're unfixable. I don't see how I could ever play with them. I'm going to try to add some like shaving cream to them or something. I'm going to make the most out of it, you know, but I definitely thought that I was going to get the Kawaii Slime and like be in love with it and like it way better than this, but no. <laughs> False. The only thing this did was made me realize how good these were. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what else to say. This is such a random video. It's probably so freaking long and I'm sorry about that. Sorry if it's a random video. If you guys want to see stuff like this more for me, let me know. If you don't, let me know. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys are the best. You're so beautiful. And I will see you in the next one. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a, a subscribe. How do you say that? Subscribe to my channel for more stupid content. And um, thank you guys for, I think we're almost at 16,000. That's freaking crazy, guys. That's crazy. Um... <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next one. I love you and goodbye.